Okay, so I know I did the Sidekick review um, not too long ago, but I also um, found something really, really cool, and I wanted to share with all the Sidekick people. So, it's actually this website. It's sklx09beans.com, and it's really, really awesome because I used to use it back when I had the 08 Sidekick, and they had really cool backgrounds, and they're free. Free backgrounds. That's awesome. Instead of paying like $2.99 for a bunch of them and then not liking them after a week and having to buy another one. So, um, I used to use those and it's really cool because sometimes when you flip it open, it'll make like a sound or it'll do like custom music or like a clip of a song or it'll have like a voice or something really neat depending on what the theme is. So, they also... Sorry, my phone. So, um, what was the last thing I said? Comes with the custom music when you flip it open, and they're free, blah, blah, blah. So, um, now they have the Sidekick 09 ones, which are different because of the quality and, I guess, the, um, megapixels that the new 09 Sidekick has. So, they're a lot more clear, and there's, like, a better HD quality to it. I don't know what it is, but it's really, really cool. So, I had this... Hello Kitty little charm thing from like years and years ago. My mom bought it for me when I was, when she went to China or something like that with my dad. But um, I also found this really cute background theme on Sidekicks09, whatever.com thing. So it matches really cute with my little pendant thing from my phone. So I thought it was really awesome and then. <laughs> I think that's so cute. So it has like pink and Hello Kitty and then if you go into like another screen it has like another Hello Kitty screen. It's really really cute and the site is really good um, for anyone that has a sidekick and likes to do backgrounds and things and stuff like that. Um, there's also a way for you to make your own themes. That will be something that I'll make a video on really soon. But it's really, really easy. You just pick a theme. You scroll through the website. If you, like, go scroll over the theme, it'll show you what the other picture that it offers is. Each um, theme should have two pictures. One for when you're in the regular screen and then one for when you click into another screen. It has different pictures and stuff. So they show you all the different um, choices that you have. And it's just really, really cool. And there's many to choose from. Right now, since the Sidekick 09 just came out, there's only 25 pages of them. There's not very many. If you go to the 08 Sidekick um, site, it has like hundreds of pages, like 900 pages, if not more. So, you're definitely in for a lot of clicking and looking through and everything like that. So, I just wanted to show everybody how awesome that is. It's really easy. You click download right underneath the picture that you like. After you click download, you save it in whatever folder you decide to save it in. I'm going to save it to my desktop. Save. Give it a couple seconds and it should download. Once it's downloaded, you open it. Click the little folder. Click Extract All Files. Once the files are extracted and you have a new screen with the extracted files, you should see all the little buttons and everything the Sidekick theme comes with. And you just put that into your actual phone with the plug that it comes with. You should, your phone should come with a USB cord that looks like this. One side connects to your computer, the other side connects to your phone. 
So you plug that in. You plug that into your computer. Plug that end, just like if you were charging it, into the phone. You, you should see a little USB symbol right on the top. Go to my computer. Go to themes. And then you just insert shadow into your theme file from your phone. Give it a minute to upload all the icons and pictures that the theme has. It closes out. Very important, you must, you must, you must, you must unplug your phone from the computer before you can check the theme. So, give it a couple seconds. You should see like a little memory card up there blink a couple times. There you go. Now, now you click the menu button, themes, and there it should be. It should be shadow right there. And there it is. So that's how you do that. Really fast, really easy, really simple, but do not forget to extract the file. If you forget to extract the file, it will not work. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I hope it was useful for everybody that doesn't know about it yet. And... See you later. Bye.